the baseball bat industry is actually a multi-billion dollar industry in the world. Uh, choosing a bat is a, it's a very important thing for a young ball player, and you all want to really uh, have a good bat. Uh, one thing I'd recommend on the younger kids in t-ball, don't spend too much money on a, on a bat because a player will grow out of it fairly quickly. As they get older, uh, they'll want to keep up with their teammates, whatever, buying bats. And again, I wouldn't recommend buying the most expensive bats. Now, what a lot of parents do is they'll buy a bat for a Christmas present, which is December. Keep in mind that kids from 7 to 12 had tr tremendous growth spurts. And to buy it like four months before the season starts might not be the best idea. You might want to wait on that and buy the bat like one or two weeks before the season starts. The other thing is check with your league, make sure the required barrel size. And when you buy a bat, lighter is much better than heavier all the time. Now this is a very important video clip to help your baseball season. Another excellent fundamental of base running is the importance of the left arm which helps establish a powerful first cross step. Having the base runner explode with his left arm will help transfer this explosion to his legs and forcefully swing his momentum toward the next base. In this drill, the coach will stand just off first base while holding out a glove waist high. The base runner, upon moving off the base, will reach for the glove with his left hand and bring it with him on his way to the next base. Grabbing the glove forces the runner to swing his left arm and the rest of his body to the next base in order to establish a proper crossover and build enough momentum for reaching the next base safely. 